Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Chestermere, Alberta, Canada, with a uh, frauditor who gets a, a bit out of control when a police officer asks to check the tent on his uh, car, which is pretty much a law in Canada, just as much as it is in the United States, where certain uh, states only allow for so much tent. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy watching this frauder act like a complete giant man-child baby. So I'm being pulled over. I'm being pulled over and harassed again. Can I what? Roll up your window, please. I ain't rolling up shit. Smart. I ain't rolling up shit. The f you talking about? Roll up my window. Did you roll up your window, please. For what? That's what? is that a lawful? Did you pull me over to ask me to roll up my window? Yep. Get the f out of here. What's your name and badge number? I'll give it to you when I get when you. Y'all give me it now. Okay. You're gonna. You just assaulted me. What are you doing? I'm a handicap. You goof. Oh boy. We got one of these, one of these idiotic frauditors who wants to play the handicap card. Dude, grow up. You're gonna you just me, you idiot! You're gonna Okay, it jumps from this camera view to another camera view, and there seems to be a bit of a time jump, so we don't exactly know what happened in between here, but uh, the officer appears to be giving the frauditor a little bit of a lecture at this point, and uh, Will is going to have to tolerate a lot of verbal abuse from this frauditor, so let's carry on, shall we? A little longer than a few minutes later. Reasonable amount of respect. Fuck that! You put you your hands on me. You, you put your hands on me. After you, you were put your hands on me. I didn't yell at you. You're, you're unlawfully. I Dude, quit lying. It's all on camera. The, all he asked you to do was roll up your window so he could check your tent. And by Canadian law, that is a thing. And you started off by screaming at him. And well, you acted like you were in charge of the stop when it is supposed to be the officer who has control of the stop, not you. That pulled me over. You unlawfully pulled me over. You unlawfully asked me to roll up my windows. You didn't see me with tint, so you have no reasonable article of suspicion that they are tinted. You they just are. did it to be a dick. Wow, you moron. His RAS for the traffic stop was the fact that he thought he saw window tint on your vehicle, which in the... The province of Alberta is a violation of vehicle code. So, dude, get your damn story straight, because you're just making yourself look like a complete moron here. No, I didn't. So go f yourself! Yeah. I'm not helping you investigate me! Kick yes, rocks, man! Get the f out of here! Yes, you are. Get out of here! Yes, you are. I can't walk! I can't walk! Yes, I'm a paraplegic, you idiot! Where's your, where's your thing? It doesn't matter where it is! Okay, give me your eye, give me your eye. No! You didn't lawfully pull me over! Call another sergeant here! Sorry to burst your bubble, dude, but this is a lawful traffic stop. He did articulate the rationale behind the traffic stop. It was window tint, which is uh, the law in that province, you freaking moron. Call another sergeant here. You fucking put your hands on me and assaulted I am, me. I am all the authorization you nope. No, you put your hands on me. I want to speak to someone else. Talk to somebody else. Talk to somebody else. Give me your ID. Nope. Absolutely not. Give me your ID. No, absolutely not. Give me your ID. Don't worry. You already got one lawsuit. Let's make it blah, another blah, one. Blah, blah, blah. Let's make give it me, another one. Okay. Okay. Give me your ID. Okay. Ask Andrew, Andrew A. Smith what's going on with him. Go ask him. Okay. Let's let's see. Okay. Let's see. You put your hands okay. on me. You assaulted me. I can't wait to go okay. file a complaint. You're a paraplegic, eh? Does it matter? Does it? Does it? It doesn't matter. It does matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, Leave me alone. I don't want to talk to you. I haven't done anything wrong. I've absolutely done nothing wrong. Leave me alone. I have given You're harassing me now. I have given you are you, harassing me. I have given you fucking a harassing request. me. Look at this. He's harassing me. I've given he you pulled me over for no reason and he admitted that. No, dude. He gave you the RAS and then you started acting like a petulant, spoiled little brat. But here's the thing. If you had done the right thing and at least you rolled your windows up a little bit and showed him that your windows weren't tinted from the beginning, 
maybe this would not have happened. Maybe this would have just went smoothly, but you just had to cause a lot of drama, didn't you? He pulled me off for absolutely no reason. He put his hands on me. I and now look at him trying to talk to me. He put his I hand head in my car. He's on my fucking... You. Get out of here. I don't want to talk to you. I have given you a legal request. Get out of here. No, you haven't. A lawful. Have. We'll fight it in court then. I'll see you in court. You Fuck want. off. Give me a ticket if you want. I don't I care. I, I haven't done shit. Driver's license, please. No. I'll give you a ticket. Give me a ticket. I'll give you a ticket. Give me a driver's license. For what? For, a, for, for refusing to... Name and badge number right now. Yeah, 1519. 1519. What's your name? Uh, Sheriff Touche. Sheriff Touche. Touche. K U S C H E. Okay, perfect. Good. Perfect. Good. You fucked up today. No, I didn't. This is all on camera. Good. So is mine. So is my front and my back dash yeah, cam. Yeah yeah yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. You don't care. That's how you are out here. Fucking cowboys. Yeah. Always trying to rope up a nigga, trying to fucking assault me because you are fucking a racist piece of shit. Oh, you're bringing in the race card, huh? Well, let's take a look at your uh, channel, shall we? Well, look at all these screenshots of these officers that you have encountered this past month. I mean, uh, there are a variety of races right there and nationalities and all that. I mean, the one on the lower right-hand corner appears to be a Sikh. So what, I mean, you're saying that everybody, every cop is racist toward you? Or is it just that a, you have a problem with cops in general and you just want to cause an issue? I'm sure that's what it must be. All right, okay. So give me a driver's list. I ain't giving you shit. Hmm. Well, you got to Help! Yeah, you think it's funny, eh? I think it's hilarious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're scream. violating me. Scream. You're violating me. Scream. Scream. You're violating me. Go ahead, scream. Yeah, yeah. Scream all your life. Yeah, you're going to be you're going viral, buddy. Yeah, that's right. I hope you're, so. Yep. Yeah. You're going to so. lose your pension. How old are you? Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. Standard fraud or threat. These officers are not going to lose... Their uh, pension over a petulant, spoiled little brat like yourself. So, so shut the hell up when it comes to that because you are wrong. How old are you? It's none of your business. Well, okay, you're gonna it's lose your, your pension for no, fucking I, with me no, for no I'm reason. Not. No, I'm this not. is what you call policing, eh? Trying to give a nigga yeah. a case for has absolutely done nothing. This is how the white cops do you out here, guys. Try to give what a case? Yeah, yeah, you? yeah. You, you just want to say the word, don't you? Yeah, that's why you're saying yeah. what, huh? Yeah, just trying to give me a case. I've done nothing wrong. Haven't violated okay. a traffic fraction. Right. I haven't done nothing. And you're okay. sitting here putting hands on me. Okay. I have... uh, everything that guy just says bullshit. Thank you. Got your, your plate number. I don't give a shit what you have. I have you on recording right. assaulting me. Um, if you would have had it, then you would have posted it, and I have seen three videos on this on your channel, and not one of them has him assaulting you. So if you actually have proof of that, then show it. If you don't, then you know what you are. You are a damn liar. And you know what? You gotta lie to fraud it. So put up or shut up. I will be seeing you again. Yeah, we will be seeing you again. Okay. You know that. Yeah. My lawyer will be in contact with you very shortly. Okay, give me your stuff. I ain't giving you... For what? You need a lawful reason to pull me over. Good Why did you pull you. me over? Let's get it straight now. Let's get it for the judge. Okay. Why did you pull me over? I pulled you over to check, check you for tint. Okay. Which and, I am lawfully allowed to do. Okay, and now that you know that there's absolutely no tint on my window, what are you going to do now? Roll what are you going to do, partner? Roll up. Roll up. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? No. You, already, you already violated me. Okay, no tint. Yeah, no fucking tint. So you pulled me over for no reason. No, no. No, dumbass. He pulled you over to check your tint to make sure you were in compliance. If you would have just cooperated, rolled your window up a little bit so he could use that little machine or whatever to check it, this would have been over a long time ago, but you just needed the drama for your pathetic little YouTube channel. No, no, I, I, no, 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 you relax. You're the one that wouldn't give me your name and badge number and assaulted me. Yes, I did give you my name. For what? Because you wanted to see if I had tint because and I don't have tint. Okay, first of all, you don't have tint. You're not getting a ticket. 
Perfect. So why you pull me over? Because I'm lawfully. Because I want to check you for tins. Oh, you want to check me for tins? Shouldn't you wait till you see if my windows are up and I have tin? And then actually fucking pull me over, you idiot? You know, it would be easier for you just to put up your windows and uh, let him check for the tent, right? Rather than giving him all this BS. Because you only just make yourself look like a complete jack wagon at this point. Because, well, you know, this whole thing could have been over in a few seconds and you would have been on with your day. Like, this is bad police, and I hope you have kids and a daughter that sees this. Blah, blah, it's gonna blah, go blah. viral. Okay. You're such a goof, man. No. You're the worst cop I've ever seen. Really? Yeah, you're worse than uh, Andrew A. Smith. Oh, brother. Okay, bye. Okay, bye, sweetheart. Bye, cupcake. Help! Help! This guy assaulted me. I'm going straight down to file a complaint right now. Well, you would think that would be the end of this, but wait, there's more. Tomorrow. Hey guys, um, Alberta Rights Media here. I was just assaulted and um, by an officer, a uh, sheriff, um, pulled me over for absolutely no reason. He even said it was for no reason. Why must you turn my office into a house of lies? Dude, you really should check your videos because they can prove whether you're a liar or not. And in this case, you certainly are a liar and not a very good one because he gave you the RAS several times and he did not assault you because you did not show that part. So therefore, you're probably a liar on that part too. Um, not only did he assault me, he smacked the phone out of my hand not once but twice. Oh, poor little baby. He smacked the corner of your little hand. Oh, good grief. Why don't you go home and cry to your mama? Maybe she'll uh, get you out a batch of warm chocolate chip cookies and give you some milk. And then she'll give you your favorite blanket and you can go home, go to bed and cry yourself to sleep. I mean, come on, dude. I mean, you can't take a little little bit of a love tap on your hand. I mean, you must not have been played any physical sports or anything like that. Because, because if you can't even take that, man, you're a real wimp. Oh yeah, and I got a question for you. If you didn't classify those two slaps as assault, then what did he do to assault you? I mean, I don't. Uh, did he grab you on your hand or your arm or anything like that? Because it looks like that you're perfectly fine. I mean, I don't see any marks on you. Um, I think he was him and Andrew A. Smith probably trained together, um, and. I'm here trying to file a complaint at the RCMP. Um, this just happened. I'm gonna upload the video here in a second. Um, absolutely no reason. This is the shit I'm talking about, man. These guys are so aggressive. They're they're terrorizing me. They're fucking stalking me. And it's like I I can't even ask for help, and they just laugh at yo. This guy's laughing, and the, yo, this shit is disgusting, yo. Um, and now I've been sitting here already. I called the RCMP uh, to make a complaint, and they they don't even fucking care. They ain't sending nobody. Oh boy, you're a real bright one, aren't you? You called the police on the police rather than going up the chain of commands to maybe something like internal affairs to try to start an investigation to file a complaint or anything like that? Oh wow, you're a real genius. I called 911, um, so it's a phone record of, of me calling and, and stating exactly what uh, my perception of what happened and then I also have the my dash cam videos and stuff, but <sighs> Man, I was not expecting that on my birthday. Today's my birthday, yo And I'm just driving trying to go get my girl some coffee, yo And this is the shit that happens to me, man. This is the shit I'm talking about, man. These guys is out of control Fucking scared for my life, man funny how you didn't appear to be uh, terrified out of your mind in that video. It seemed like you were uh quite aggressive in this one where you were uh, trying to order the officer around and everything like that and uh, well acting like a complete damn fool throughout the whole thing and therefore I really don't blame the cops for laughing at you one damn bit because you know what 
I could see, would see you as more of the village idiot than anything else at this point. But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.